Well, hey there, creepy critters, and welcome to Playhouse of Terror. We are trash people from the dump. I am Theo Monstar. And I am Aunt Gore. And um, this is like our 18th day of Halloween. I don't know. <laughs> Halloween? <laughs> Valentine's forever. Yeah. I planned way too much, but it's fine. It's fine. And we can't go anywhere, so we got to do all of our Valentine fun stuff at home. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so today we have just some more... Yeah, Valentine's Day and also, yeah, also the mail has not been on my, it has not been on my side at all <laughs> for getting everything in time, so. Mm -hmm. Okay, um, let's see here. We'll do that last. Okay. We should have brought a drink back. That's all right. Um, I think first, did you bring back that big chocolate? I figured we'd taste that and taste a few of these chocolates that we showed you in the Yeah, we're doing the vegan previous video. It's we'll have a link below for that video if you want to see It's our Valentine's Day stuff video. Yeah. Which is probably similar to what this is going to be called. <laughs> okay, this is from Vegan. This is going to be the sexy episode, though. We're going to show you some uh, sexy yeah, mystery so... box. So. If so, you're a child, uh, go we'll put away. put up some kind of warning before we get to that. <laughs> Anyways, here's a little vegan chocolate. Chocolate, vegan, vegan chocolate. Mm. Oh, it's filled with stuff. <laughs> yeah, I knew it was filled with stuff. I can't remember why it was filled, though. The cherry? Mmm, -hmm, it's good, though. It is really good. Mm. It's very fudgy. It's some kind of fruit. I can't remember what. Mmm. <laughs> That's really. Oh my Theo god. Theo approves. Yeah, it tastes like fudge. It's really good. Okay, so now we're trying the vegan treats. Fatally yours. Fatally yours. Ghost tour. Chocolate box. <coughs> we don't need to try all of these. No, we'll just try like a cool, some of the cool. These are some of the flavors they have. Um, this. The coffins are Swiss chocolate with uh, black uh, express espresso ganache. Um, ghost hearts. Those are salted caramel. No, Bolivian rosé or rose. I'm not sure. Salted caramel. Mm -hmm. um, the banner is just candy. Um, candy bar. Just yeah, yeah, yeah. The skulls on the side are Swiss chocolate skulls with Speculoos butter, which is the cookie butter. Ooh. I might have to try that. Mm -hmm. uh, five, the ghost cats are white chocolate strawberry crunch. The skull in the middle, the big skull, yeah, is uh, cookie dough. Ooh. Um, the leaves are raspberry black sesame Swiss mm. chocolate. Wait, no, not the leaves. Um, the, these things. These ghosts. Oh, the little. The little ghost. Yeah, the little I ghost. Show it, but can't see um, it. Eight is. Well, I, I have a good picture. Yeah, I can, that's right. Yeah. I'll just leave the picture. Up yeah, just leave me at. There we go. Um, eight, which is the um, the flower skull. It's white chocolate ganache. Um, the leaves are mint matcha mint chocolate leaves. Ooh, matcha. Ten, which is um, the X and the O. Um, that's hazelnut praline, mm -hmm. and then of course there's only, oh my god, why is there only one of those? The bottom on my boo is peanut butter mango Thai coconut. So, so which ones do you want to try on camera? Well, why don't we Let's just go ahead and split, split that, that one. one. I'll eat bite, and then I'll take the second bite. The inside just kind of looks like, I don't think this is going to show up, but it kind of looks like a cookie dough. Inside. Almost. Mm -hmm. I'm good. Mmm. Okay. This is probably the best chocolate too. <laughs> if you've ever had like those no bake peanut butter chocolate coconut and oats balls, like if you ever make like those like little protein balls with that, that's what that tasted like. That was really good. You want to try? The giant school. Yeah, we'll do the giant school, and then we'll do one other one. We'll just do three. Yeah. I know these are all gonna be delicious because these are all tasting delicious. 
bit off his jaw. What was this again? Cookie dough. Mm. It's good. All vegan too. But even if you're not vegan, mm. you would enjoy these. <laughs> yeah, you wouldn't think, you would mm. almost think a the cookie dough taste would get covered up by everything else, but no. Mm, it's that's so really good. good. Mm. Try one more. Do you want, what were the cats again? What were the cats? Just a strawberry crunch. Mm. Oh, there's, there's the specky too. Like the specky you don't care which one do you want to do? Um, we've got so many that are already cookie. I want to do the strawberry crunch, I think. Okay. Okay. Yeah, I guess we can just eat our own. Spooky kitty. Meow, 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 meow. Oh, good. Mm -hmm. I'm really curious how they make the white chocolate. Because white chocolate is like not chocolate at all. It's all like just like milk solids and stuff. So I'm really curious what the uh, vegan substitute is. I'll have to ask, um, oh fuck. Blink on her name. You good here? Why can I never remember anybody's name? So yeah, I can highly, highly, highly recommend that. Even to people who um, don't care about vegan stuff. This is really good. <laughs> if you're a chocolate lover, it's like It's super please. cute if you like horror and mm -hmm. Halloween. All their stuff. molds are really nice. and mm -hmm. They real, look like really nice candies. And they're delicious. Man, that was really good. That was really, really that good. That was really, really good, yeah. Okay. Next, this came just the other day, so I can show it now. I already have pictures of this. I can't remember the name of the, does it say in the card? Uh, it has that on it. No. Well, this is a really cute card. It says it that on all of them, though. No, oh, wait! It's Dolce Calabarita. Yeah, we'll have a link below. Yeah, I'm I can't remember for sure, but I guess I guess that's probably it. But uh, that's a really cute card too. I don't remember if I got that or not, or if that was just added extra. But and that's a cute, you know. But uh, where did the other thing go? How about? <laughs> oh yeah. <laughs> Are these earrings or pens? No, they're uh, like lapel pens. Or, yeah. I don't know how I was gonna show up, but I do have pictures. And Let's then. See. Those are so cute. I can't wait to wear those when I get closer to Halloween. Or just all the time. Every day is Halloween. <laughs> okay. Are we getting to the adult portion of our show? We are, yes, we are definitely. Even though it's all the adult it's portion? It's all the adult. There shouldn't be kids anyway, but now if you have a sensitive palate to erotica, <laughs> you might want to leave the show and go watch some, I don't know. Christian entertainment. So first up is an artist that we've been following for a while and is local actually. Um, and we also uh, we got this because uh, we follow them on our It's red velvet Patreon. cake. Patreon. Oh, what is? That's what's in there. <laughs> it's totally cake. Oh, it tasted fruity though at first. That's yeah, weird. but then I ate it and I'm like, this is totally cake. Yeah, I think, I think that it just sounds because, like, familiar. At first, yeah, I my brain's like, are, yeah. cherry? Is it cherry? But no, that first thing we ate, I took another bite. I don't know. know what it was, but it was delicious. It's totally red, but well, it's cake. It's definitely cake. But these are anyway. from uh, Boudouin Art. They have a Patreon as mm -hmm. well, and we'll have links for all of that. Yeah. Um, but I love their awesome art. Awesome artist, so yeah. Much. Mostly does kind of science fiction erotica. Yeah, that's yeah. Kind of like what I yeah, I guess that's, I yeah, that's say some of it is. It's amazing, wonderful. We art. have a really cool uh, yeah, alien we'll art. Piece. Let's show it right show here. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> but I'm they, not censoring that out either. That's art. No, I'm pretty it's, sure it's protected. Yeah. <laughs> well, and we say that you have to be 18 if that and older. So. Blurred lines asshole can show his video and so censor, perfect. then I can do. I can show some artwork. Um, these are some amazing Valentine's cards. Oh yeah, we'll probably have a picture. Yeah. And then, um... Uh, I like the one that just says pee on me. <laughs> <laughs> I missed your butt. And then we got the start so print cool. too. Yeah. That's really pretty. I love their art so much. Yeah, they do awesome art. 
Okay, and last, but certainly not least. Oh, actually, this isn't the last. The last thing I'm gonna say, yeah, is the most special. No. <laughs> but uh, this is, um, I think it's Ink, ink Shop. Yeah? Yeah. Uh, they had a like sexy Ooh. for Valentine's uh -oh. Day uh, mystery box, so I'm guessing this is gonna be a It's gonna toys. get a bit naughty in here. A little spicy. This well, that's not very spicy. Oh, actually, it is. <laughs> yep, it's candy. It's a candy stick with candy dicks. You never know when you need some candy dicks. I'll take oh, pictures. Last year, oh, last Valentine's Day, I handed out candy, uh, yeah, uh, so lollipops, lollipops, dicks. dicks to our friends for Valentine's Day. That seems like so Memories. long ago now. Ooh, we don't have any furry ones. <laughs> furry handcuffs. Are you sure we don't have furry handcuffs? I don't think so. <laughs> Maybe. I don't think so though. No, if you were watching her, things I didn't need to know. <laughs> now you do. We warned you. Hey, we, we are you a this very sex pod. We think sex positivity is very important. Yes. So, if you don't like that, then go away. <laughs> go, watch, go watch something else. Plenty on YouTube to choose from. You don't have to watch our show. But sex positivity is so important. There yeah. should be no shame in sex. As long as you're not, it's consensual. Consensual adult sex is very important. Yeah. <laughs> it's, it's good for your health, like literally. Um, yeah. We're not doctors, we don't need to tell you about that. <laughs> We're just a couple dorks that like playing with stupid stuff. Oh, that's so cute. It's a bracelet and it says, I fucking love you. Aww. And I put it on my tiny wrist. It's a little tight. Don't worry, Mr. Jeff. I fucking love you. I mean, you can't read it from here. I'll put it on the, I'll put it on the thingy so you can see the pictures. Yes, pictures. The thingy. <laughs> this is, uh, X-rated candy heart. Ooh. Says things like lick me, let's fuck, sexy ass, blow me, nice tits, eat pussy, sugary pussy. Nothing's quite as classy as telling person nice tits. Nice tits. Ridiculously large knife to open these. Sexy ass is another one. Okay. There we go. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I'm like, why am I too fat for these? And I'm like, oh, I'm not putting it in anything. I've been locked up. Now I'm in all the trouble. Fuck me. They're still pretty uncomfortable. These cheapo handcuffs are the worst. They're cute though. Eat me. These will be fighting. great, like dangling from something. It'll be fun to like put on. We should like, I don't know, do something funny with it. Mm-hmm. Those are cute. Those are cute. Okay. okay so I got to look at the handcuffs. What else did we get? These are the X-rated candy hearts. Big dick. Eat me. Strip for me. I'm horny. <laughs> Sugar pussy. That'd be a good name for band, Sugar Pussy. Well, I think we have our year cut out for us. A year of sexual sex position cards. Vision. Like we're that limber. <laughs> I do yoga. I can do. These are not the a normal. Couple of these. <laughs> these aren't the normal chalk hearts. They're like solid sugar. Oh, really? Almost like a sweet tart that's not tart. Oh, it's not tart though? Hmm. It was just sweet. It's good though. Because it's got candy in it. I don't know if this will fit. Sugar is my might. favorite flavor. It's really cute though. The lingerie. Okay, 
cheapo porn or porn shop launch bay. The best kind. Okay, I've had enough sugar, I think. Okay. No, I bet oh. I love you. <laughs> That's cute, cute. too. It's very helpful too. If you don't, if you don't know uh, anything about anything, it, it like it like explains the technique on each card too. <laughs> this is really cute. First, you're gonna need all the bananas. Ooh, I like that a lot. Is it a shirt? Mm-hmm. I see. Is it just stuck here? Yeah. There's. Oh, it's a skull, I see. Yeah, and it's got like, it's like really Yeah, but it's, that's really cute. It's really yeah. cute. Know, it's we'll try and get a better picture of it, maybe. Okay. Yeah. That was it for that box. Well, that was cute. That was really cute. But pretty vanilla for a sexy box. I'm just saying. Yeah, for, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> but if you're, if you're new to like anything. That, that's a good, that's a good starter yeah, box, though. It's a good beginner's kit for... That kind of thing. And just a fun, funny, like, Valentine's Day gift. Okay. okay, next up we're going to talk about pot-related things. So if the sex didn't scare you away, <laughs> maybe the pot will. Okay. So I've been following them for a while. Um, they have these awesome... Oh, well, you're... Should I show Go ahead first? and start talking about those. I need okay. To oh, I forgot the t-shirt that's all right i'm sure i'll wear the t-shirt on the show in, a, in another episode maybe for 420. um uh, <laughs> no i got these no. nasty old joints that we've been saving <laughs> they were pretty nasty when we got them yeah that's what happens when you buy cheap shit and it tastes like cheap shit okay so a month full of tobacco in case anybody's wondering or worried about One that of the kind things of thing. you can get from their shop, uh, this is uh, just the tip if I didn't say that already, um, is this uh, hemp lighter, which are very handy, and I've been, I am needing one for a while anyway, so that's great. Um, they also have hemp cones, which I'm, we haven't looked up how to use these. I haven't actually used these before. And then, of course, like, for scooping and stuff, these fake hundred dollar bills, and then yeah, it's I just think this it's is just rolling paper. Yeah, it's just one of these. Oh, it is. Oh, yeah. it's just confused by it being called a cone. I see, because it's like that shape. Yeah, I'm so smart. Okay. Yeah, anyway, that's what that is. these are the extra goodies. I also got a T-shirt from them. Uh, but the main thing. You drop everything off the ground. Is very appropriate, especially now with COVID safety and everything. Even, even once you get your vaccine, you're not going to be wanting to pass germs around. So, no, I'm not. <laughs> this is not going to work very well. If uh, okay, not only is it beautiful. Also functional. So we'll try and take a better picture of this too. She does it. I don't think she has many of the bedazzled ones you get on her site, but she has all kinds of beautiful colored ones. And I think she's gonna start making these. But this was a special one that uh, she uh, sold uh, for auction. And oh shit don't remember what the uh, charity was but it was a charity to help people get out of jail for stupid pot related crimes um, which we need to stop making that illegal in the first place but that's I'm a whole gonna, show this up close. here's the wick lighter that I cannot fucking figure out how to use but these are fucking just so pretty and uh, 
very functional. So anytime you're out with a friend and you wanna share a joint, then uh, you don't have to share germs at the same time. <laughs> and it's a really pretty necklace. <laughs> So, and so you don't breathe in all the toxic toxins. Well, and then you don't have to keep holding down while you're lighting. Or a lot of times, if you're like you're doing like a bowl or whatever, and then like the flame. Like, yeah, sometimes it's hard to get. Yeah. Uh, the torch lighters are better. For the bowl. Yeah, torch lights are better, but this will work in a But pinch. I mean, again, if you're worried about toxic chemicals. Where did the uh, joint go? I got it right here. <laughs> Should I just light it in this and show that? Yeah, sure. We'll take a picture too. And it's like a little thing, you know? Yeah. Alright. You know, I'm not gonna bother lighting it. You're not, oh, I just figured it'd be fun. <laughs> oh, I don't. I gotta open up the window. Okay. We will. <laughs> but anyway, yeah. We can take pictures later. Yeah, we'll we'll take pictures later when we light it. Yeah. But yeah, so that's really cool. As you drop it. I it again. Down. <laughs> that's why it's on the necklace. Is that it? I think that's it for today. Yeah. Mm -hmm. That's all for this this specific video. <laughs> yeah. So like, subscribe, share, and all that jazz. Um, make sure to check out some of those links below. Yeah, yeah, we'll have shops. links for everything. A lot of these places are small businesses. Yeah. This isn't big conglomerate no. thing. <laughs> so you're helping out people's Especially business. Especially this one. She's real small, but she has awesome, gorgeous things. So. so check out all that kind of stuff, and we'll see you next time. Bye-bye. Go! Oh! Turn it back on. It's already on. No, it's already on. Okay, we're not done. We're not done. Because I forgot. I wanted to just like briefly talk about one more movie that could have been tacked on to our uh, video that's already up. <laughs> the uh, how, uh, horror movies for Valentine's Day. I, I would, I've, I've seen this pop up a few times in my feed. And I'm like, oh yeah, that would have been a perfect one for that. Um, the Loved Ones would also be a fantastic Valentine's Day horror movie. It's a watch. I mean, it's not exactly Valentine's Day, but it. Some of our. It's about uh, love. Basically, yeah. Basically, like <laughs> I considered um I considered any like romantic subplots in horror. Yeah. Like if that's like the main kind of idea, if it's surrounded on the the idea of love or relationships, that, that's yeah. Valentine's Day horror. Yep. <laughs> um. So again, uh, yeah. 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 Thanks for watching. Um, like, subscribe, and all that jazz. And we will see you next time. Bye bye.